Hey, people. Sorry about that, mostly like that. Already going wrong. I'm going to do a little uh, show, a little review on our pack testing bag. Um, so, yeah, I'm just going to show you that. It's a quick one. And the next few videos are going to be some, some reviews on some tools. Uh, get them in. I have got a video to record soon on the beach and a pumping station with Trey and whatnot. So we'll get some footage of that. There's no one there. It'd be nice. Hopefully it's a nice day. No rain. We don't like rain, do we? Not the sparks. No. So yeah, let's get into it. Get some uh, get some more lights on as well. So you can you can see it better. Alright. There she is. You've probably seen these before. These CK test bags, they are good bags. No, not got anything in there. I don't really take that much of us when we're pack testing. Uh, strap on. Alright, strap. You know, it's a few years old this and it's 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 doing us alright. Uh, we don't usually pack testing the uh in, in no, dirty places or anything like that and so it's usually like offices and shops and stuff so I'll show you inside um, just what we use for our pack testing it, it fits nicely there we go good zips on them fix it so in here the, we did have tools in here um, but generally we keep them in our pockets see the screwdriver and cutters and, and stuff so Anyway, so up here we've got uh, some spare uh, fuses in there. Um, that'll we'll just keep them in there because there's some stickers that we need to cut. Well, yeah, you can put your tools in there. You've got a couple of you can put your pliers in and some cutters and screwdrivers, whatever. Um, yeah, that's it. you're not going to need a lot anyway, are you? Usually keep our labels in here. That's ours. Just keep them in there, folded up, fail stickers as well. So anyway, I'll get you. I'll get us all set up here. I'll get us all set up. Bear with me. So what we've got is inside. This is the pack tester we use. See with Apollo 500. It's good. It does its job. Uh, we've had it for this. We've had this for a while. We have it, you know, calibrated and whatnot. Uh, but yeah, it's it's a bit it's a bit big, a bit weighty, but you know you, you're going to buy something that's decent. It's going to be in it. So that's what we've got in here. Uh, it, you could charge it up, so we keep all the all the leads in, charging it. Every lead that you ever need, we pack testing, pretty much anyway. Uh, but yeah, so see extension leads and whatnot. Doing your class one fittings. Yeah, we all know. It just gets to, you know, you're doing, you see if things have got an earth and whatnot. But every single lead in here, I've got everything, I've got a spur, spur? spur plug tops. If we need to change them, we'll just keep that in there, uh, keep them in there. So you have to go to the van. If it's, you know, it's simply just the, the, the plug top needs uh, changing so spare these are spare ones if we run out of them on the job I've always got spare ones and obviously you can change the actual appliance number on the machine as you go along just a bit of some bobs as you can see yeah that's inside the bag There's loads of room and you can just use this as a normal test bag to be fair um, your fit tester in there and all your bits and bobs and screwdrivers it's that's what we use for our pack testing so I, I would recommend it they are a bit pricey but yeah I'd, I'd get one I'd get one if you were if you're willing to spend the money on a decent pack tester if you're doing it a lot this is your this is your this is your one I'll put the link down below uh, if you see if, you, if you're interested and you can have a look and there's all different ones anyway you get better ones than this uh, you can go. I think it's go up to like a thousand pound on a pack tester. But if that's what you're doing all the time, recommend buying that. It's uh, it's done it for us anyway. 
So that's that. Just a short one. Show you what we use for pack testing. Um, it's a pack tester, but you don't really. I don't really see many videos on pack testing. To be honest, we all know it's boring. No one likes to do it, especially when you're on a job when he's thousands of items so that's my pack testing kit let me know what you have in yours or what you use anyway thanks for watching so it's only a short one take care i'll see you soon